Lanky Box's twin sisters are going to react to a story about how Lanky Box, Adam, and Justin became friends with their school bullies. Hey, yo! Hey, I'm doing the <laughs> That's right, our bully turned into our friend. Really? You've never told me that story, big bro? Yeah, I want to hear the story. Please tell it. Okay, but you guys gotta promise to listen to the whole story, okay? There's a bunch of super embarrassing parts in it. Hey, yo, Adam still does that. He just cries. No. <laughs> Deal. All right, guys, time to hear the story about how our bully became our friend. Let's go! Guys, today we're gonna be reacting to how our brothers became best friends with their bullies. And stick to the end of this video because Justine's gonna show you guys her pranking Justin. It's so funny. All right, guys, let's get right into it. What is up, guys? Welcome to this episode of Lanky Box. Yeah! Today, Justin, I'm gonna tell you the insane story of how I became friends with my school enemy. <laughs> okay, now this story is pretty intense. You ready? Okay. Okay, now this story starts when I was nine years old. Oh, so man. fourth grade. Okay. Now, you okay. already know, at this age, I was a little quiet. <laughs> hey, look, Adam's wearing that Pikachu shirt. He would always wear it every day and never eat even watch it, guys. Ew. He was stinky. No. <laughs> All right, guys, this is when he was nine years old. That's a long time ago, guys. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, what, like a million trillion years old? He was quiet. I had a few friends, not much going on. Oh, really? But there was a new kid in our class named Jack. Jack. Hey, yo, hey, Jack. But he looks kind of cool. He said, yeah, look at him. He's kind of cool. Okay. Now, let me what up. was Jack? Jack. <laughs> He won! Oh. So Jack was this new kid at our school. This was like the first year he was at our school. Yeah. And he was literally held back a year, so he was like older than all the other kids. <laughs> yeah. And Jack was super scary. Like, okay. he went through puberty like really young, so he was like really tall, and like his voice was a lot deeper than everyone's. Yeah. He was, like, very, very scary. Right. Now, Jack was actually my enemy. Now, I remember one time at recess, we were playing freeze tag. Like, you know when you like tag someone, you have to freeze? Yeah. I would be like tagged, I'd be frozen, right? Jack would just come up to me and just kick my leg. Hey, yo, Adam still does that, he just cries. <laughs> Justin does to Aido now. Like as hard as he could. It was like actually really mean. Like, yeah, that's not funny. That's actually kind of dangerous and violent. Yeah. But why? Okay, but did he pick on everyone across the board? No, just, you? just me. And I remember at recess one day, like me and my friends were like playing Foursquare. Oh, and like, yeah. oh yeah. He ran into the center and he took the ball from me and threw it at my face. <laughs> Yo! Hey, Joking. I bet he oh. did that because he didn't like you because you went up to him on the first day of school. Wait, maybe you can't see my eyebrows because my bangs. <laughs> he went. <laughs> and remember, guys, I'm going to show you a super funny, embarrassing prank I did on Justin after this. <laughs> so, so stay funny. tuned, guys. And make some cringe. <laughs> no? no? Like, hey, Jack. What's your favorite fast food restaurant? <laughs> Jack in the box! <laughs> and Jack was like, oh, I'm, I'm getting you back for that one. I don't tell cringe oh, jokes. Yeah. Mm, debatable, I do mm, debatable. debatable. Yeah, here we go. So, okay, so he threw the ball at your head. Did it hit you? Yeah, it hit me right in the face. And like, oh. I went home that day and was like crying to my mom about how like terrible of a day I had. Yeah. And so my mom was so cool. She literally literally called the school and asked for Jack's mom's phone number. She called Jack's mom oh. on the phone. Oh. And she was like, I want you to ask your son to stop teasing my little boy. Did it work? <laughs> yeah, not no, it didn't work. work. <laughs> what? For a little bit it worked, but then he went right back to picking on me. Now, okay, here's where this story gets a little interesting. So, as I mentioned, I had a few friends at this time. It was basically me and a couple other boys. We would, you know, play Pokemon, we would hang out, play video games, whatever. Now, in school, I had the genius idea of calling our friend group the Carrot Club. <laughs> hey, yo, the Carrot Club? <laughs> it's because he looked like a carrot. <laughs> 
we called ourselves the Carrot Club. Oh, so what you're trying to say is that you were ahead of the curve. Yeah. You were the original cool kids. I was like, oh, like we need like a name for like our friend group, like me and two other guys. And I, I guess I was eating carrots or something. I just picked the Carrot Club. Carrot Club. And like everyone had a name. Hey, you didn't this is probably not true. I eat him only drinks milk. <laughs> yeah. Like one of my friends, he was small, so he was called Lil Carrot. Oh, this is true. His name was not <laughs> Lil Carrot. No, it was. <laughs> It. Yeah, it was. Carrot Club more like cringe club. <laughs> what you mean? There was another guy called Baby Carrot. And my name, which I picked for myself, was Big Carrot. You picked your own name. You gave everybody else a little carrot baby no, carrot. No, everyone picked their own name. Everyone picked their own name. It was a lot of fun. So yeah. we would all be like, oh, what's up, big carrot? Oh, what's up, baby carrot? It was a fun day. It was pretty stupid. But like, I remember going home that day and telling my family about it. I was like, yeah, we have this new club. And my dad was like, oh, that's kind of funny. I actually am going to make something for your club. And what he gave me that night was a stack of dollar bills. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Baby, this is how Adam has so many robots. <laughs> we secretly spend. Don't tell him, guys. But what? on the dollar bills, what? instead of presidents, it was carrots. <laughs> and he called it carrot currency. Much like how Justin has what? Justy Box, where he put his face on a dollar bill. <laughs> Do not compare Justy Box to your cringe carrot <laughs> cryptocurrency. No, dude, this was sick. It had like carrot dollar bill and like had a bundle of carrots but it looked really real now i i i'm gonna pause this your parents are great people wonderful people but i'm gonna just say this they made your life so much harder <laughs> why because they're literally your mom calling jack's mom your dad giving you carrot currency they're making your life at school very hard no dude my dad actually is like really good in photoshop like the the money looked really sick and so the next day at school, I showed up with like this stack of dollar bills and I handed it out to Lil Carrot and like Baby Carrot, all my friend group. And I'm not joking, the club became like cool. Like people wanted to join that weren't even my friends. And it got to a point where people were like, oh, like, can I join the Carrot Club? Like maybe if I like buy you lunch or like, oh, I'll do like your homework. I'm not joking. Just as cringy. I'm not. I'm not. Literally, I was. I was uh, shook because uh, it literally became uh, cool. Because if they joined the club, I gave them a carrot dollar. <laughs> so literally the club became so popular, it even like girls wanted to join. Hey <laughs> yo, oh, hey yo, that's gotta be that's, camp. That's not true, that's not true. I don't remember that part, Adam. <laughs> I'm not making this up, you can ask my parents. <laughs> This literally happened. <laughs> and so the club was just like rampant. It was just going everywhere. People were like, oh, like I'll, I'll, I'll buy like you lunch for like a week. I was like, make it two weeks. And they're like, okay, okay, okay. Just to get in the club. I mean, I was basically like the the king. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. This is what Aiden wishes he looked yeah, like. Yeah, this is hey, not yo. real life, guys. Guys, stick to the end of this video because we're going to show you a prank that Justine did to Justin. It's so funny. It's crazy, guys. You don't want to miss it. Of the class oh, at that time. I know where this story's going. Then I then I moved up. I promoted from big care to big care. <laughs> <laughs> no, where this going. I should have done that, though. Yeah. Okay, flash forward. Basically, everyone in the class had joined at this point. Every single person, the class had like 20 kids. I think 19 of them were all in the club. They all had names. It was sick. The only person that had not joined was Jack. <laughs> and Jack came up to me one day. I was sitting there, you know, just surrounded by all the free food that people have given me. And he was like, hey, um, do you think that I could join the carrot club? And I was like, no way. That was like, that was, it felt so good to say no to him. Because all this time he had teased me and he finally wanted to be like my friend. And I was like, no, no way, get out of here. And then I was like, wait, I'm kind of becoming a bad guy. You are. We were all like, the entire club was like hanging out one day. We were all like passing food around, having fun, playing games. And Jack was literally just alone on the other side of the classroom. That's pretty bad. It was yeah. like really sad. I, like I was just sitting there and like everyone around me was laughing or whatever. I just saw him like sitting there just alone and just like looking sad. Oh yeah. And I was just like this is this just doesn't feel right wow. like it doesn't feel right big carrot got a big heart <laughs> so 
I was like, I I need to make a change here. Like, this is not gonna work. So I remember I was like, I started walking over to Jack, and it was just me and him in the corner of the classroom. I was like, hey, Jack, like, uh, I actually changed my mind. Like, do you want to join the club? Oh, wow. And he was like, the reason why I was teasing you and he told me this, he was like, it was because I was being picked on in my old school. And he was like, I just didn't want to be that same kid that got picked on. So he was thinking, maybe if I pick on you, other people wouldn't tease me. And I was like, that's still, that like still sucks for me. But like, I was like, man, that's so sad. Like, wow. this kid was in the exact same position I was in. And now I did exactly what he did. I started teasing someone else. So I didn't get teased. I was like, you know what? I'm going to put an end to this. I was like, Jack. I'm sorry, he said sorry to me. I was like, Jack, please come join the Carrot Club. Wow. I gave him a dollar <laughs> and he was like, okay, I'm in. And like, he walked across the classroom, he joined all the other kids. And it was like, actually like such a heartwarming moment. Wow. Like, he joined the club and me and him actually became like really good friends. Let's go! I know, right? Would you like to join the Carrot Club? Hey, yo, wait, we <laughs> wanna join the Carrot Club. I wanna join now? <laughs> Be Justy Carrot. No Chromey Carrot. <laughs> and you even get your own Carrot Dollar. Hey, how would you be? Whoa. Me? Me would be the Big Brain Carrot. That would be the Big Brain Carrot. What would you be? What would I be? You'd be, you'd be the Purple Carrot. Oh, the Purple Carrot. Purple carrot. One hundred percent. Sign me up for the caring club. Okay, I don't actually have any, so I should go print some. Let me call my dad up. <laughs> wow, guys, that was a really moving story. It was, but now it's time to show you the <gasps> prank that Justine did on Justin, guys. It's so funny. Let's take a look. Okay, guys, we're here about to bring Justin right now. So he's over there sleeping in his foxy head, but we're gonna replace his donuts with these fake ones. He's gonna be so upset, guys. All right, Eddie, go hide, go hide. Let's go, let's go. For some donuts, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> ah! Hey! <laughs> no! <laughs> 